Hello everyone. I'd like to share a few trades that was posted on Monday 23rd by our graduate students. Uh, Yasin and uh, I think Sam posted their trades separately. I'm gonna go through other trades uh, on other instruments. This one is a video clip uh, by MF, uh, who's trading Gopher USD Japanese yen, yen. As you see, is a macro chart showing downtrend, uh, and you see the channel better in a structural chart. So there's a money left in this area uh, to go in this channel down, and he's using five minute chart to see that, and taking the downtrend entry was here. The stop loss here initial target on this uh, support resistance area, su sorry, support area. And you see he's uh, hitting a, he's a stop. And a stop, oh, sorry. And as you see, his target is filled. And as you saw, just his target was filled. Let me go fast forward to see. And he shows another reentry. And as you see with this trend line, he's managing first target is here. That is getting, okay, got filled. A second target is here. So he may um, actually manually manage this based on this trend line. He's moving the initial stop loss to trail it. And I think manually may close it if this shows sign of weakness from the sellers. Let's see how he handles this. So he closed the second. Now the second one is still here. Just a second. Now he may close it now. Anyway, he's in profit for the second target. And now close all the trades. So he had essentially two positions. Uh, both entry here, stop loss moved, as you see two position, 0.1, one was in the middle of channel, one uh, trail it and close it again in the middle with profits. Thanks for to MF for sharing this trade with us. <coughs> Next trades were uh, from AP, who's shorting the NASDAQ CFD using looks like a Forex broker. So he entered multiple position after rejection here. You see four hours, 30 minute structural, and this channel is now retested and is going down. So he put uh, um, targets uh, in the lower part is moving the target because momentum is uh, strong and give it more room for profit as you see now most of his position is closed he got got reentered again here and play the last part of video so here is reentry so he entered here got this wave four position reentered here and having position here he sent this video also, so he closed previous one with profit. Now reopened again after this very fast uh, shadow pullback. He got got rejected. He entered multiple positions. Now is in good profit and trying to close all of this based on momentum of this 
some targets is filled. I think three positions are open, one more closed, two more open, stop losses trails to maintain the profit in case this comes back. And I think one more target is filled and one left. And he's aiming to okay trail it more with a stop loss and moving the target further. So this way with the initial uh, entry risk risk is this much and reward was very large. And let me see the end of video. That's the end of his clips. So uh, so the market went down and I think uh, bounced back here and he manually closed it. We don't have the end of video. But anyway, he, is, uh, his, he can close it also here with this stop loss and trailing here with uh, significant profit. Thanks um, AP for sharing all these trades. Uh, very well done. Easy shared this picture of his trade on S&P 500. CFD, um, you see here, this is four hour chart, macro, after rejection at this level, and this level, this has room here for profit, and he, he sees that in 30 minute structure as a channel uptrend, and enters here in this area, with this middle chart, good entry, and profit one and two very good trade and um, thanks easy for sharing this trade and uh, that shows uh, initial risk to reward is very suitable plus very high win rate so about amount this risk uh, with this amount of profit and also Yasin shared this picture and he's gonna make video and post it directly on it's on S&P 500, the same thing that Easy did, uh, take the long uh, direction using a smaller charts. And uh, thanks uh, for, for sharing this also, uh, Yasin. And thank you everyone for sharing your trades and anyone who's watching this for your interest. And let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.